Yo guys, and welcome back to episode 3 of Death Road to Franada. How on earth is it going? Oh, we're still reeling from the loss of Freddy Adu. What, what's, what's happening here? We've set up camp late. Um, okay, so it's one of these again. We've got a bunch of abandoned cars and we need to cipher a bit of gas. I mean, it's late at night, so I'm going to wait until morning. That seems fine. Okay, we've got to abandon the gas in the morning because there is a large horde of zombies coming. Well, be right. I'd rather... We've got enough gas. We've got plenty of gas. And we're in a hybrid car for the time being. Uh, we get a peaceful moment to relax on an apartment roof. There's time to talk and someone reveals a lot about themselves. Um, who reveals a lot about themselves? Come on, Francis. Open up. What's going on? He reveals his true essence... Uh, Francis Coquelin is not strong, and he can't chew. <laughs> yeah, that's about right. Uh, his fitness levels aren't very high. He's not a mechanic. He's not great medically. He's not got his wits about him. He's decent composure, and not loyal at all. Okay, you're you're such a liability. It's scary, Francis. <laughs> but I don't have any choice. Right, okay, there is a mild swarm. They are sluggish, and it is afternoon. We've got a choice between furniture store and an apartment with bark on the banner, which means there may be a dog in there. Not only a survivor, but a bloody dog. Let's get at him. And I'm using this gun now, because fuck it. Freddy's gone. I've gone off the rails. Bark, bark. <laughs> he did well to make that banner. Get away from me. Why is there a, like a wardrobe in the bathroom? Oh god. Well, there he is. <laughs> I thought I'd just left Francis Coughlin to die. Hey, there he is. The dog seems unusually tame. Most dogs that are still alive have become feral. Uh, yeah, come follow us, mate. Joyce! Oh, Joyce! Rejoice for Joyce. Not a good one, was it? Uh, <laughs> right. So it's now Franny Jeffers, Franny Coquelin, and Joyce the dog. <laughs> right, and the death road to Franida continues. Oh shit, I pressed the wrong button. Uh, only junk in there, I just shot the wall. That's not advisable when you're running low on ammo. Okay, another wardrobe in the bathroom. Oh, and the toilet might have something in it. It's got a bullet in it. Okay. Someone shat a bullet. That's weird. Get off, Joyce. You get off, Joyce the dog. Uh, in fact, I think we've we've had our fill of this building. We've, we've got the dog, which was the primary objective. Oh, I'll show you this. This is quite fun. Oh, no, we can't do it yet. I'll show you in a second. Okay, get in the car. Everyone in the car. And we're away. Joyce catches up with the group at the safe spot. It's, she seems like she wants to stick around. Yes, we'll re recruit Joyce. Excellent. Franny, Franny and Joyce the dog. Let's go. Onward to Franada. Oh, Franny Jeffers has treated himself uh, medically. And he is back to full health, that is good. Right, okay, we are on a golf course and a large group of zombies is approaching from the driving range. Oh, we've got to shoot golf balls at the zombie, haven't we? We can't drive away with no sleep. Mm, don't want to prepare for siege. Yeah, let's shoot golf balls at them. Oh shit, someone's hurt. Um, oh, we're overwhelmed in the end. Everyone's hurt. Franny Jeffers' fitness levels are low. Right, okay. <laughs> this has gone so badly so far. Right, Franny Jeffers meets another survivor who rants about seeing an oiled up bodybuilder that was too swole to control. <laughs> That's a fucking excellent saying. A bodybuilder that was too swole to control, ripping zombies in half after bench pressing them. Franny Jeffers convinces the woman to give more details. She instead provides some great exercise tips. Okay, okay. Franny Jeffers' morale increases, his strength increases. 
Uh, it's still not great, but it increases. Okay. Right, the group is driving down a long stretch of road. No threats on the horizon, but not much else of interest either. Uh, we've got some food, and we've run into a trader camp, but they'll want food, so let's ignore them and keep going. We are out of medical supplies. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh. The group tries to evade a large horde. Blocked by debris, they get stuck in a Yolmart parking lot. They're going to have to fight here for a while. Right, so this is the most deadly scenario you can get, in my opinion, in Death Road to Franada. Uh, siege, which is where you've got to stay in one place. There are a shit ton of zombies, and you've got to stay there for one in-game hour. And it is, yeah, it is not great at all. Oh, we've picked up some golf clubs, which is cool. Let's not take a gun, because it's only got one bullet in it. Uh, we'll take a cricket bat. <laughs> Joyce the dog can take a cricket bat as well. That's one of my favourite things about this game. And Franny Cockerland, you can have a golf club, my friend. Oh, fuck that, you've got a gun. You've got a pistol. <laughs> that is very much swiped. There we go, now Franny's got the pistol. Franny's got a gun! Finally! Right, let's go. We just need to survive, that's all. We can come in here and look for supplies, but, you know, it's more... It's easier to get cornered if you go inside the building. Oh shit, that... Oh no! No! <laughs> come on! Come on, Francis and Joyce. See what I mean? We're getting fucking cornered. We need to get out another way. Oh, God. Oh, no. Who's dying? It's Francis Coquelin. <laughs> He's alright, though. <laughs> what has Joyce the dog picked up? My God. Zombies falling from the ceiling again. Throwing a trolley at some bastards. Come on, guys. Only 20 minutes to go so we can leave. Oh god, I've run out, but no one's with me. I might be on my own. I think I'm on my own. Come on. I can nearly leave. I can nearly leave. The siege is over. Yeah, let's hit the road. Has anyone survived? Oh no. Francis Cochrane's not here and we'll be left behind. I'm sorry, Francis. <laughs> This is such a ridiculous scenario, right? So Franny Jeffers and Joyce the dog have left behind Francis Cochrane after losing Freddy Adu to zombies. Um, I'm gonna leave it there. Fucking hell! Uh, please leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel. Pop that, I will see you next time. Bye.